contesting Saturday a primetime affair with Stanford at the Coliseum. Despite saying he expected to play against Colorado, Darren Thomas did not. Instead, head coach Chip Kelly went with Brian Bennett. And the red shirt freshman delivered with touchdown drives on all four first quarter possessions. With more from Boulder, here's Dirk Weishar. Brian Bennett's first start as a Duck was a good one as ninth ranked Oregon jumped all over the Colorado Buffaloes early, 29 to nothing after the first quarter. The Ducks amassing 527 total yards, 371 of that on the ground as Oregon won 45 to two. Just felt I had to go out there and play my rules and do what I've been coached to do all week. And, you know, we were able to do that, so it was good to, to get that first series, go out there and get a score. And, you know, good, good start to the game. Wanted to go out and kind of set a tone early. You know, I thought Brian did a nice job running, running the ball and kind of keeping them off base in terms of what he can do. And, um, you know, we did a good job up front. And tried to, and we, most of the day stayed out of the penalty game, so uh, it, it, it was good for us. That's what we're supposed to do. Our offense is very effective, and I mean, we don't, we don't bow down to anyone. You know, even though Colorado was one and six, we didn't let that, um, you know, interfere with us. I mean, we just came to play Oregon football. So an expected victory for the Ducks here at Folsom Field. Afterwards, Brian Bennett's teammates said they expected nothing less from him in this game because of his preparation all week in practice. Now the Ducks turn their attention to Washington State as the Cougars come to Autzen Stadium next Saturday. Reporting from Boulder, Colorado, I'm Dirk Weishar for Inside the Pack. Dirk, thanks. The Beavers have now won two games in their last three tries and appear at least to be turning things around. Still to come on ITP, Oregon State goes to Seattle and in uncharacteristic fashion puts on a clinic against the Cougar defense and comes out with a win. We took it upon ourselves to not be a bad team. We're not a one of our teams, so we're not going to act like it. I think we just started playing harder and practicing. The Beavers picked up their first road win of the season Saturday night, and they did it in surprising and dominating fashion. Phil Milani has more from Seattle. The Beavers were running on all cylinders in their 44-21 victory over Washington State on Saturday night. On the ground, Malcolm Agnew ran for 103 yards and one touchdown, and Sean Mannion had his best performance of the season, throwing for 376 yards and four touchdowns. The Beavers were so good, they only punted the ball once in the entire game. You guys were making plays. I mean, we either ran the ball and got in really good situations for third down, or we completed passes for uh, first downs. And, and uh, I thought time and again, guys came up with just really good football plays. I think it was a good job, both of us being bounced, you know. We had a good run game, a good pass game. Both of those clicking together, it's hard to stop us. I mean, we score really quickly, you know. That always says a tone like, hey, we're coming, we're coming, we're coming, you better be ready. So I'm really happy we did that, and that really propelled our offense, I think. We just kept working during the week. We had another great week of practice, and it's, it's paying off. I think we came out here and executed well. Um, you know, and that's all we're, we're really trying to do is execute the plays our coaches call, and uh, I think we did that today. All the Beavers agree this is the type of win they could build upon, and up next for Oregon State, Pac-12 newcomer Utah, another road game, this time in Salt Lake City. City. With the Beavers in Seattle, I'm Phil Milani for Inside the Pack. Phil, thanks. We're just about to wrap up this edition of ITP. On the other side, more Ducks and Beavers talk. Saturday Scholar Time, Nick. Boy, it's a quarterback-driven game. We know that. Sean Mannion is the engine that is going to move that program forward at Oregon State. At least they hope he will. Jeff Torch and the Cougars in his fifth game, starting career high, 367 passing and four scores on Wazoo. Steve, what you got? Brian Bennett, quarterback. Story continues. This kid's playing like a seasoned vet, and it's only his first start. I look forward to the future with him. Well, he does look pretty good, and he had command of that offense on Saturday against Colorado. My scholar goes to the entire Stanford run game. A school record 446 yards rushing against Washington. Stephen Taylor with 148 yards rushing. Taylor Gaffney, 117. And Anthony Wilkerson, 98 yards on the ground in a dominating effort by the Cardinal. Thanks to Steve Bach for joining us here on Inside the Pack. And thank you at home for watching. Next week, Ducks host the Cougars. Beavers head for Utah. We'll see you then.